We want to use the uh, Shelly Tasmatizer board. This is it. It's got uh, two connectors, a five pin connector here, and uh, currently a six pin connector, although the later models will be seven. And there's two types of uh, Shelly. The, uh, the older one, like this, the Shelly 1, which uh, you put in like that all the way. And the newer Shellys look like this, which you put in. Now you need to have this end here, which is labelled ground, all the way to the edge there, so it's actually like that. Okay. Now there's one other um, that they used for a little while, which is the uh, Shelly Dimmer which also uses these tiny connectors, but it's not the same place. And this one actually you need to put in this way round. Like that. Having done that, you use the uh, Tasmatizer web page to program it. And uh, there's uh, two options. The, the older shell is like these are 8266 based and you just load the ordinary Tasmatizer, the Tasmota software. The newer Shelly Plus models, which you'll see like this, Shelly Plus One, these are ESP32 based and you need the Tasmota Solo ESP32. It needs to be the Solo because it's a single core, not a dual core, which is more common. I'll speed this up because obviously it takes a little while to erase and program. Okay, so it says complete. We can now uh, configure the Wi Fi. and it lets you then visit the device. It's quite clever, really. And there you have it, a programmed TASMOTA into a Shelley.